Yo, what is going on guys? Um, this is Delmont's here. Um, in this video, I'm basically going to be showing you guys how to set up um, some IP sniffers or network sniffers. Um, you know, debating what you want to call them or whatever you want. Um, so, anyways, what that what this is, tutorial is going to be about is pretty much uh, just jump into a lobby, this is console or you know phone or whatever you want. Um, and just basically pull IP address for simple SDOS attacks. Um, I believe I've done a video on this in the past, I'm just not sure. So I'm just going to go make this new one. It's going to be in depth and it's going to be for you guys. Um, so, of course, whatever program you want to do, such as can enable or Lance, whatever program you want to pick, Lance is fucking autistic. If you use it, you should go definitely to um, the Aldi's because your SSL broke and pick up a bottle of bleach and, you know, probably kill yourself. Um, you know, with that being said, that's just that. But I'll go ahead and have both downloads in the description below because we know there's always autistic people out there and likes to use the shitty software. Um, so anyways, um, <laughs> once you guys have it installed, of course it's going to ask you to install WinCap and stuff. Um, and make sure you just have that installed or whatever. And when you first open this program up, it's going to say, you know, Windows Firewall, just hit OK. Um, and it's going to come up with a tab about configuration. Just go ahead and close out of that. I'm going to show you what to do step by step so we can do this together. Um, so just basically want to go up here. You want to go to configure. Um, and what we're going to do here, guys, is we're going to configure our network card. So can enable can read the incoming and outgoing um, traffic flow, kind of like what Wireshark does. Uh, Wireshark's a little bit more advanced for advanced users. Um, I'll do another tutorial on it later. Um, and, you know, right here's my WinCap version. If you guys want to go get that, um, I'll leave that in the description too. Why not? Um, so, anyways, if you guys don't know what your IP address is for your subnet um, or anything like that, I'm gonna go ahead and show you to do that as well. So you just basically want to hit your flag key and you want to hit R on your keyboard. Um, if you don't know what a run is, um, I severely um, feel sorry for you and something is is wrong with you. Um, so basically, you just want to type in CMD. You can run this as administrator. Our regular, whatever your choicing is, and basically you want to do is you want to type in IP config C O N F I G, and then you guys want to hit forward slash all. Oops. Um, now you don't have to do forward slash all. All just gives me pretty much all my network, um, you know, everything that's connected all at once, and I can just view it. So I just want to hit enter. Um, okay, and it's going to bring up the network card. I believe I'm using number two. These other ones are my virtual machines. Uh, yeah, okay, so right there is the subnet, um, which, you know, of course, that's, hello, all, um, and basically down here, you don't have to click any of these, I just always click this, you know, for the hell of it, um, and you basically want to hit apply and okay, um, and then what you want to do is you want to go sniffer, I'm going to remote, none of these are going to be in here for you guys, so you just, I'm just going to remove them, ignore that, so you want to enable this tab up here, okay, you want to click on this box, you want to click the plus button, and you want to click scan your entire subnet. Um, now, for you guys that don't know what ranges are, pretty much you tell the program to scan from point A to a specific point B. Um, pretty much just what fucking all subnet does. It's pretty much what it does. Um, <laughs> and then basically, you just want to hit OK, and it's going to scan everything that's connected to your, um, you know, network or you know whatever you're using to uh, sniff. Um, and then, of course, right here is my PlayStation, and then my main uh, default. Um, so once that have that set, right here is fucking kick. Um, oh, if you guys want to do a video later on in the future of me showing you how to, you know, pull IPs from kick, you know, go ahead and let me know in the comments below. I'll be willing to do that too. Um, go ahead and APR tab at the bottom here. I had that for the tutorial when I failed epically, and it was retarded. Um, so just want to click in here again click the plus button again you want to click your main um, network or uh, whatever you may be using and you want to click whatever you want to scan the device so remember my playstation was 10.0.6.23 so I'm going to click that shut the fuck up or I'm going to kill you these guys want money on GTA <laughs> um, and then basically you just want to start sniffing um, and it's basically just going to pull a list of IP addresses um, you know, it's near lobby or that's connecting um, or that's being linked and that's connecting to this device. 
Um, yeah, okay, whatever. Um, and then guys, if for those that don't know how to tell whose IP is who um, for each individual client, so say you want to find Monkey Jew 666 or something, um, <laughs> you just basically want to mute that person and that individual IP address is going to stop receiving packets incoming and outcoming. Um, it's pretty much the same traffic flow and the same setup for Wireshark as well. The Wireshark is not really used to sniff. Um, you can, but it's not used for that. And that's pretty much it on this tutorial on how to set up Canable. Um, if you guys want me to do one on Lance, I really don't want to. Lance is fucking autistic, but you know, if you guys need it, I'll do it. Um, so go ahead and you just want to click exit on that. It's bipolar. Um, and before I end this video here, guys, uh, I'm going to go ahead and basically say that uh, Hellmaker V6, um, or V6, not V6, but V7 and 7.1. Um, it's going to be out soon. I'm just really working on um, just getting the lag out um, for you guys. A lot of you guys are complaining and you're worried about, you know, the lag is just too much. For me, that's not lag at all. I don't know what the users are experiencing. I've only, you know, only had a few out of the 400 people that have purchased this tool um, complain about lag, but I'm trying to fix it for you guys. Um, it's just really hard due to the fact that there's so many tools in, in, in my tool. Um, you know, I made a whole new UI that uses less resources on your computer for you guys. Um, you know, if the main loader just doesn't work, use the fucking um, new UI. It's just it's pretty much it. I really can't do much, but I'm going to work on it. Um, and with that being said, just go ahead and leave a like on this video if you did enjoy it. Leave a comment down below if you want to see more of this later on in the future. Also, leave a comment down below if you want me to do a tutorial on how to sniff um, IPs um, through Skidkick, um, is what I usually call it. Um, and that's pretty much it. This has been Del Mods, guys. Again, if you enjoyed this video, smack it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.